I'm Ariane Aaron Bureau with your FastCast digital headlines for this Monday, taking a look at today's top stories that we're following. What is the Anchorage Health Department doing to look at congregate shelter? Is there a congregate shelter in mind? What is that location and when are they going to tell the public? That's Anchorage Assembly member Felix Rivera at its last regular meeting. The Assembly voted to pull roughly $2.4 million in unused American Rescue Plan funds to cover costs of the emergency cold weather shelter plan. This week's meeting promises additional discussions on the same topic. In addition to the regularly scheduled Assembly meeting, tomorrow there is also a public hearing regarding additional funding sources, including a $1.2 million grant agreement between Catholic Social Services and AHD up for consideration. The public meeting begins at 6. A heads up on a closure here in Anchorage. Repairs begin this morning on the northbound lanes of Bergraw through the DeBar intersection. The roads are closed because of the collapse of a storm drain. The drain is about 30 inches wide and more than 300 feet long. Maintenance crews are replacing the piping, so expect delays or just avoid the area if possible. And an Alaskan whose family was stuck in the war-torn country of Sudan, where a war is ongoing, is back in Anchorage after a three-month journey where he says he helped thousands escape to safety. John Reek rented 14 trucks to bring what he says ended up being more than 4,000 people to safety. The largest trucks could fit about 500 people in them, each enduring the roughly two-month-long journey from northern, southern, northern to southern Sudan. Reek says there was not a single fatality. It was a risky trip, as much of Sudan is still feeling seeing armed conflict, crime, among other things. The purpose of the trip was to take my family out from Sudan and also the people who surrounding them, and I cannot leave them alone there. Even there were many left, but I did the best I can to take out whom I took out with my family. And those are your FastCast digital headlines for this Monday. I'm Arianne Aaron Bureau. Have a great day and thanks for watching.